Northeast India, comprising of seven states commonly known as Seven Sisters, Arunachal Pradesh, Assam, Manipur, Meghalaya, Mizoram, Nagaland and Tripura, is a true frontier region. It has over 2,000 kilometers of border with Bhutan, China, Myanmar and Bangladesh. One of the most ethnically and linguistically diverse regions in Asia, each state has its distinct cultures and traditions. From time immemorial, India's Northeast has been the meeting point of many communities, faiths and cultures. A place renowned for its magical beauty and astounding diversity, Northeast India is home to more than 166 separate tribes and many more sub-tribes speaking a wide range of languages. Some of these groups had, over the centuries, migrated from places as far as Southeast Asia. They retain their cultural traditions and values, but are beginning to adapt to contemporary lifestyles. Northeast jungles are dense, rivers powerful, and during the annual monsoon, the rain and the thunderstorm sweeps across the hills, the valleys and plains, the lush landscapes, and the range of communities, the geographical and ecological diversity, make the Northeast quite different from other parts of the subcontinent. In 1922, the Catholic mission in this region was entrusted to the Salesians of Don Bosco. The Salesians of Don Bosco were the pioneers in educating and evangelizing the region. And the province of Dimapur was started in 1982 comprising of the states of Upper Assam, Nagaland, Manipur and Arunachal Pradesh. The Northeast is one of the most underdeveloped regions in India in skill training. Since 2010, the province of Dimapur worked hand in glove with Don Bosco Tech in skilling the Northeast in technical and other job-oriented courses. Don Bosco Tech is a network of 176 Don Bosco skill training centers spread across 25 states in the country, making it presently the largest NGO in skill training in India. Professional and technical training I received from DB Tech has helped me tremendously. Today I am a manager of SJ Electronics Shop in Dimapur. I am Nikki's grandmother. She completed her training from Don Bosco and now she is working. With her salary, she is helping our family. All the centers provide employment-linked, market-oriented, short and long-term skill training to the economically and socially marginalized youth. I was a candidate for DB Tech and right now you can see how I am since they have built me up in a very such a perfect way so right now the position that I have it's all because of DB Tech. Today he's helping and supporting his brothers and sisters in their education. Right now I'm a supervisor as well as a trainer for UK Chef. I used to give all the training for UK as well as this I used to look after the floors and all. We are very thankful to God. Today, because of Don Bosco, Tokato is earning and helping the family. His father is very old to look after the family. Tokato is the only breadwinner in the family. Don Bosco Tech in Dimapur province aims at imparting skills to the youth of the area, built on solid model principles, based on character formation. Most of the young people who work into our training institute come with habits of consuming tobacco products, drinking, smoking, and with similar other products, which is unacceptable in corporate environment. I came to DBTE Training Institute without any hope, but the three months training that I attended changed my habits and attitude. We are able to change their bad habits through regular counseling, personality grooming, and offering them a tight schedule of training. At the end of this three months training, we have a bunch of young people who have transformed themselves and ready to work in corporate environment. Once skilled, they are able to earn an honest living and thus become useful to the society and country. Now, I am working with NEPCO, a well-reputed company. After working in this company, I have improved my skills in electrical works. When my daughter went to work and sent money for the first time, I felt very happy. We believe that the youth of today can be entrepreneurs of tomorrow 
in turn creating employment opportunities for others. My daughter could not continue her studies because of the financial problem in the family. But now, after training and securing a job, every month she sends home 5,000 rupees, by which we can repay the loan taken for her father's treatment. She also helped her brother financially to start an internet cafe. The major centers of skill training in the province of Dimapur under DB Tech are Don Bosco Vocational Training Center Dimapur in Nagaland, Bosco Vocational Training Center at Maram in Manipur, and non formal training center at Golagat in Assam. Skills imparted are driving, electrical fitting, welding, motor mechanics, and carpentry. In 2010, in collaboration with the Ministry of Rural Development, Government of India, Don Bosco Tech in Dimapur province was able to spread its reach to the remotest areas of the northeast, establishing training centers in many parishes, youth centers, and other institutions. I am Shobha's mother. My daughter got job after completing her training at Don Bosco and now she is working at Natu Resort and helping us in many ways. We are all very happy. Our life is better now. It's just because of TP Tech. I am what I am. Now I can support my family and I'm happy to be here. Every job in our network group is very important and DB Tech play a key role in the continued growth of our Company. Skills such as mechanical trades, incorporated employment-oriented service sector domains such as hospitality, ISMO, industrial serving machine operation, spa, front office management, housekeeping, beauty and hair care, food and beverage service are short-term courses with greater employability. The intense training imparted is well accepted by the candidates. I am in Kerala for two years and in these years I was able to support my father in running the family. I will save something every month and plan for my future. I am the father of Rashmiri. She is working in Kitex company. With the money she sent, we have bought a pair of oxen, land and a motorcycle. A successful economic development strategy must focus on improving the skills of the area's workforce. When I got my first salary, I was very happy. Through that salary, I could support my family. Our family is changing. When we need financial support, Suchita helps us. I think in coming days, I have to earn more money and build my future. That is my vision. From July 2010 till 30 September 2013, Don Bosco Tech in the province of Dimapur has achieved this by training 4,173 young people and placing 3,030 of them in reputed companies like the Taj Group of Hotels, JW Marriott Hotel, Taj Vivanta, O2 Spa, Kitex Garments Limited, Shahi Exports Private Limited, and so on. The fruit of our three months labor of training rural dropout youth is measured by the placement we do. The mode of the training that we impart in DP Tech is quite holistic. We ensure that their groomings are imparted as per the requirements of the industry. Their behaviors are well polished. They are also spiritually guided. And as a result, they become productive partners to our society. We truly feel proud when we hear from the employers that these rural youths are able to meet the demands of the corporate world. As a result of the three months training that we impart, it is very encouraging to see many of our candidates getting increment and promotion as a result of their performance and commitment to their responsibilities. The takers for the short-term course are on the increase because the parents and the trainees find the training centers sufficient and effective, as these not merely provide a skill to the young candidates, but also groom their personality, while providing them a skill to live by. With help of DB Tech, I am able to help my family. I don't have any problem because whatever work we are doing, it is for ourselves and we are happy here. I know Don Bosco. Through Don Bosco, young boys and girls are trained and placed in a job. 
At their workplace, there is no danger to their lives. I fully believe in that. Skill training has created an honorable livelihood, character strength, inner security, and unique personal worth and pride. This is my daughter. She took training from DB Tech and now she's making a living by herself. I would like to encourage all the unemployed youth in our society to enroll in the training program and make their future like my daughter. The service industry is a booming industry and the people of the Northeast are well in demand right across the country. The otherwise lost lives in the remote areas are now engaged in making a happy living for themselves and for others. After coming to Kitex, I'm able to make a decent living. Back home, we had to depend on others for every single need. Now it has changed. We are able to live a decent life now. My brother is able to continue his education. Life has changed for good. Because of Anila, we have opened a tea garden and made house. Skill training is the gateway for better living for most of the youngsters in the northeast. The province of Dimapur, encouraged by the outcome of the training programs, now targets to train 35,000 youngsters in the coming 10 years. I am a trainee of Spa Domain. When I walked into the DPTEC Training Institute, I was a shy person. I was not sure if I had complete the training, but I should say the soft skill training has completely changed my personality for the better. It's a great privilege for me to work with DBTEC, the largest NGO engaged in skill training in the country. It's been two and a half years since I'm working with DBTEC. Every day in the organization is a new day for me with new challenges. In DBTEC, the trainer too gets an opportunity to utilize our skills and develop our personality. Here we work as a team molding and shaping our trainees to achieve their dream. I'm sure that I've made the right decision in joining DBTEC. Don Bosco's predilection for young people is well known. His heart constantly went out to those in need. Today, Don Bosco Tech, imitating Don Bosco, is reaching out to those less privileged young people by skilling them, who otherwise would be left alone in society. Let us join hand in building the lives of the underprivileged youth of the Northeast by empowering them through skill training to become nation builders.